Hello guys, welcome to Statistics Bio 7. I am Dr. Mohan Athanari. Now we are the discussion topic for interpretation of ordinal logistic regression in Arjun Bro. How to analyze ordinal logistic regression in Arjun Bro? That video already published in our channel. That video link mentioned to the this video description box. So the continue part of the interpretation of ordinal logistic regression in Arjun Bro. The ordinal logistic regression is a statistical modeling technique used to do predict an ordinal response variable based on one or more predictor variables. Unlike linear regressions which assumes a continuous dependent variable, ordinal logistic regressions handled data where the outcome variables has a natural order but the intervals between levels are not assumed to be equal. This method is commonly applied in fields such as social science, medicine and biological science to analyze order outcomes. Arjun Bro provides an intuitive interface for performing ordinal logistic regressions, offering detailed output including parameter estimates, model fit statistics and diagnostic test to assess the validity and performance of the model. By interpreting those outputs, researcher can identify the significant predicting and gain insights into their data underlying structure. So the first one table for the parameter estimations of ordinal logistic regression in Arjun Bro. So the first uh, four predictor value present for the normal blood pressure and hypertension blood pressure, age and gender. So the conclusion of the table, the not statistically difference from the zero, the all the predictor values. So the coefficients and the standard error, valid test, t test, p value also present in the parameter estimations the table. The table of the interpret interpretations present the the parameter estimations for the ordinal logistic regressions model are present in the parameter table. The coefficients indicate the effect of each predictor variable on the log orders of being in a higher category of the response variable. The normal blood pressure concerned the term 0.73 is not statistically significant p is equal to 0 0.66 suggesting the no significant impact on the orders at the reference level so the pre hypertension blood pressure the coefficients 2.15 for this level is also not statistically p is equal to 0 0.21 indicating the no strong evidence that this category significantly affect the log orders of the response variable. The age, the coefficients 0 minus 0 0.02, the implies that which each unit increase in age, the log orders of being in a higher response category decrease slightly. However, this effect is not statistically significant. P is equal to 0 0.42. The gender the coefficients minus 0 0.39 for males compared to the females is not significant. P value is equal to 0 0.57. The indicating the no statistically significant difference in the response category based on the gender. The none of the predictor variables show a significant effect on the response variable at the 5% significant level. The conference interval for all coefficients include the zero, reinforcing the lack of significance. So the second one table for the model fit statistics, the statistics and the value presented, the number of literatures, the 10 and number of the point 30, the total of the parameter statistics, the present in the second table, the interpretation of the table two, model fit statistics. The number of list status, the model 
coverage after 10 literatures suggesting an appreciated fit para process minus 2 log likelihood the value of 65.13 the provide a measure of the model fit which can be compared to other model for improvement archive information criticisms aic the aic value of 73.13 provide a measure for model comparisons which lower value indicate a better model fit the Bayesian information uh, criticisms BAC, the BAC value of 78.73 also as in the model comparisons. So the model fit statistics for a Pesido R square statistics, the Cox and Sanil 0 0.02, the indicate a small proportions of variations explained by the model, the MC patterns value 0 0.01 also a low value suggesting the model explain the minimal variations the adjusted mc button minus 0 0.10 the negative value indicate potential issue with model complexity relative to the complexity power the nickler 0 0.02 which is low further confirming the limited predictive power overall the model explain a small proportions of the variability in the response variable so the third one table for the model test the present for the likelihood ratio test and equal slope test the parameter for the high square value and degrees of freedom p value the conclusion of the model test the model is not statistically better than the null model so the interpretation of the model test the likelihood ratio test the high square value of 0 0.78 which 2 degrees of freedom and a p value of 0 0.67 suggest that the null full model of is not statistically better than the null model this indicate that the predictor variables do not statistically improve the fit of the model to the data the equal slope test the test result minus 2 log likelihood 64.20 the high square value 0 0.93 the p value 0 0.62 support the proportional orders assume as the p value is greater than 0 0.05 this implies that the assume of equal slope across the response category is valid for this data the table 4 for the covariation matrix the parameter for normal blood pressure prehypertension blood pressure age and gender so the correlation matrix the interpretation for the table 4 the covariation matrix show the variations of each parameter estimate along the diagonal and the covariance between the parameter estimates in the half diagonal elements the diagonal value indicate the variations of the coefficients the highest the value is associated with the interpret for the blood pressure prehypertension the category 2.98 suggesting a relatively higher degree of uncertainty in the estimate the lowest variation is associated with the parameter of age 9.02 the indicating the higher persons in this element so the covariance matrix of diagonal elements indicate the covariance between the parameter the instance the covariance between the intercept for normal blood pressure and prehypertension blood pressure is 2.82 the suggesting those estimates are positively related. The covariance between the gender and the age is 0 0.004 indicating a weak positive relationship between the, those parameters. So the fifth table for the correlation matrix, the parameter present for the 
normal blood pressure, prehypertension, age and gender. So the interpretation of the fifth table, the correlation matrix, normal, normalize the covariance to the show the strong and directions of linear relationship between the parameter estimates value range from minus 1 to 1. The diagonal elements are 1. The representing the performance correlations of each parameter with itself. Of the diagonal elements revealed the strength of the relationship. A high positive correlation 0.97 exit between the intercept of normal blood pressure and prehypertension blood pressure, indicating this estimate are strongly related. A strong negative correlation minus 0.95 exit between the intercept for normal blood pressure and age suggesting that as no increasing the other decreasing. A weak positive correlations 0 0.20 exit between age and gender suggest a negligible relationship. So the conclusion of the ordinal logistic regressions Analyzed performed in the origin bro revealed that none of the predictor variable, the including age and gender, the blood pressure category for the normal and prehypertension had statistically significant effect on the ordinal response variable. As all the p values exited the significant threshold of 0 0.05, the model fit statistics include a minus 2 log likelihood value of 65.13, AAC of 73.13, BAC of 78.73, indicating a moderator fit of the data. The PESIDU R square value COVAX and SANIL is equal to 0 0.02, the MC button is equal to 0 0.01, NEGLERI is equal to 0 0.02, suggest a limited explanatory power of the model. The diagnostic test including the likelihood ratio test P is equal to 0 0.67 and equal slope test P is equal to 0 0.62. The confirmed that the model was not statistically better than the null model and unheld, upheld the proportional orders assumed. The covariation and correlation matrix analysis further highlighted the strong relationship among the intercept and a negative relationship between the age and blood pressure categories. The overall the result indicated that the predictor variable do not significantly influence the response variable. The warranting the further explanations with additional predictor or alternative modeling the approaches. Okay, this is for the section of the ordinal logistic regression interpretations in analyst for the origin bro software. If you any doubt on this analyst for the ordinal logistic regressions or the interpretation of the ordinal logistic regressions, leave me the comments in the comment box. And if you like this video, click to the subscription button for my our channel and support to me join to our channel membership. Thank you for watching this video.